This is Nine News with Peter Overton. Good evening. He was not long ago dubbed the most popular politician in the country. But with his government in turmoil, Mike Baird is being backed into a corner on his controversial Greyhound racing ban. With a grim result widely expected in the upcoming Orange by-election, unhappy colleagues have forced the Premier to reassess the industry's future. What you're writing about horses? The Premier on the brink of a political lesson. Nine News understands Mike Baird is seriously considering softening his policy on greyhounds, possibly putting the ban off until 2020, all because of an expected voter backlash at the upcoming Orange by-election. So you're completely ruling out any possibility of a backflip? Look, I'm, I'm ruling out uh, the possibility that I'm going to make uh, any decisions other than what I think uh, is the right one. Polling shows the government is looking at a swing of at least 15% against the National Party in Orange, a result that would almost certainly end Troy Grant's leadership. There's no doubt uh, that Orange will be a challenge. I mean, that's, that's very clear. This has made MPs in marginal seats very nervous. They're openly questioning the ban. Nine News has been told Labor is targeting 24 seats. They're confident Sports Minister Stuart Ayres will lose Penrith. Transport Minister Andrew Constance will lose Bega, Skills Minister John Barillaro will lose Monero, and Prue Goward could lose Goulburn. What people craved five years ago was strong leadership, a government that was going to do things, not look towards the next election. The Greyhound issue has become so divisive. Two weeks ago, the Premier was confronted by a trainer in Picton. Mike Baird asking a member of the public not to film the discussion. Is it illegal to film? I don't want to necessarily have a private discussion um, sort of broadcast. And Chris is live for us at State Parliament tonight. Chris, it doesn't seem to be getting any better for the Premier. It's not, Peter, and our MPs are getting themselves into position in case Mike Baird calls it quits. Any backflip on the Greyhound Racing ban would be very difficult for Mike Baird to make personally. So there is a school of thought that if the party forces him to reverse the ban, he may well just resign. That's where talk of replacement comes in. Gladys Berejiklian overwhelmingly has the numbers, but Transport Minister Andrew Constance is also in the mix. But, Peter... I must stress, the vast majority of government MPs want Mike Baird as Premier and their leader. They're just serious questions over how he's handled this mess. All right, Chris, thank you. We're going to go to breaking news now, and Marcus Stanford, the man jailed for helping cover up the murder.